I'm Evan. Let's talk about arc faults and how to troubleshoot them. So what is an arc fault? An arc fault is when electricity jumps from one conductor to another conductor through open air. When our inverter senses that, it locks itself out for safety. So how do we troubleshoot it? Well, one thing that you can do before you go to site is call your homeowner. Ask them to turn off the toggle switch for five seconds. This resets the inverter. After five seconds, if that fault comes back, then you'll know you need to go to site. So once we're on site, first thing you're gonna do is de-energize the system. Turn the toggle switch off, let the system energy bleed out, turn off the DC disconnect, turn off the battery, turn off your AC breaker. Next, let's take off the covers and inspect for any damage. If there's no damage or debris, we will replace the top cover and then we are going to test one string at a time. So the other strings that are present, we're gonna take them out, we're gonna cap them so that they don't arc, and then we're going to put the cover back on, turn our AC breaker back on, turn our DC disconnect back on, toggle switch on, and run the system for about five minutes. We wanna run the system for about five minutes or so to give an opportunity to the system to warm up through thermal expansion to create those conditions where the electricity will jump from conductor to conductor, right? So once we've let it run for a bit, we, and there's no arcing, we'll swap out the strings, test the other string, and if there is still arcing, or if we find arcing on that string, there's a couple things you can check. On the roof, you'll check your J boxes, your jumpers and your any field made crimps. Uh, and what we're looking for is anything, anywhere where there's any loose connections or places where electricity can jump, right? So on the AC side, it's rare, but you'll just wanna make sure that all of your connections are nice and tight. I hope this helps. Happy hunting, power off.